I'm Jay from Twist and Tie Balloons um, and today I'm going to show you guys how to make a T-Rex dinosaur out of balloons. What you're going to need for this is you're going to need two 260Q, um, I'm going to use green uh, balloons. You can use whatever colors you want but you want them to be the uh, same color unless you get some special request uh, for different legs and a different body would not. And then you're also going to want another 260Q yellow or whatever color of your choice. You want it to be different from the actual dinosaur because it's going to be like his eyes and part of his mouth. And also a marker, sharpie, whatever you want to draw his eyes. So let's get started here and give my balloons a little stretch. And uh, just take it. And give it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'd say eight pumps. Let out a little air and give it a tie. Same with the other one. Give it a little stretch. Let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Um, let out a little air. Now, for the I one, you're only going to need uh, maybe even one pump, if that. See, not even. Um, I'm just going to let out a little air right about there. And for right now, all I'm going to do with this is tie it off. That's it. So I'm going to grab the first balloon, and I'm going to make a, a one-inch knot, and I'm going to pull up all, sorry and give it a pinch twist. Then I'm going to go about two inches and make another two inch and um, connect those right there. So we have one pinch twist. Then what I'm going to do is actually I'm going to make another ball. You want it to be roughly the same size as the first one. And then give it a pinch twist. So what you have here is that. Um, I'm going to go down about that long. T-Rex is going to have a super long neck. And then give his arms. And remember, at the same time, they don't have like, super long arms either. So I'm going to make a one-inch ball and give it a pinch twist. Now, here you're going to make just a tiny little ball just to connect them. And then another about one-inch ball. And do the pinch twist for his other part of his hand. And then you're going to want to make his arm. Same size as that first one. And connect the two. So this is what you should have so far. Pinch twist, two inch, two inch, pinch twist, the neck, then one arm, a pinch twist, a little tiny little ball in there, another pinch twist, and another arm. You're going to want to kind of push all the air, make it so it fills out the rest of the balloon. Come down a little ways. And you're going to make a, um, a twist and make a little ball. Whoops. Anyways, you're going to make the ball one inch, maybe a little smaller, and pinch twist. So there we have the dinosaur's um, first part of his body. I just want to check the time on this. Perfect. Just if I do it too long, they won't upload good for me. Anyways, now we're going to do his feet. Um, start off, we are going to make like a little um, two-inch bubble. I'm going to make that a little smaller. Two-inch bubble and another two-inch bubble. And I'm going to connect the two. Put it between the balls, the nozzle. Make another little one-inch bubble. And give it a pinch twist. And you're going to want to come up about four inches. Make a leg. Make another little one inch ball or small right around here and then a pinch twist. Then we're going to come across. I want it to be a little bit squishy because we're going to connect the uh, upper body there. So then we want to do about four inches or so, maybe a little more, a little less. Another little ball, pinch twist. Then you're going to come down about four inches, the same length you want it to be as your first leg. Do that. Um, Make your little uh, two-inch ball for one foot, another one, twist it, then do your uh, your other ball for your pinch twist, and pinch twist it. Now, this access, if you have it, you want to get rid of. 
Got my scissors here. Head over here, I'm going to give a little knot. You don't always have to do the knot, I just like to do it, that's me. And then you just spin it around. And you can cut off the extra. There we go. Now, what you can do is you can take these eyes. You want to kind of hold it there, that's what works for me. Push it all in. And um, then you want to get it, you want to get it pretty good to halfway. I don't want his eyes to be too funny. Um, connect the two with the nozzle and this piece. Give it a knot. So here we go. Now you can do this as soon as you get the T-Rex's head done before you do the rest. It doesn't matter. Take the two. Put the nozzle in one. You want to get it squeezed in there. So wrap one around, maybe the one pinch twist. And wrap it around the pinch twist the end. Now what you want to do here is when you twist this end, you're going to then come around this mouth part and come around here. And then you're going to wrap it around in there. You can hide it. You can cut it off if, you need, if there's extra if you want. So here we have the front of the dinosaur. And here's his leg, so we're going to just uh, twist that right about there. You want to make it a little as even as you can. You're going to then grab it where you did the pinch twist on the tail, and you just kind of spin it in there so it locks into place. Um, and then you just kind of move it around to have it the way you would like it to look. Uh, and there you go. Well, actually, we're going to draw his eyes on however you want to do them. I'm just going to do uh, circles here. And there you have it, folks. There is a T-Rex dinosaur made out of balloons. He's fairly simple, very easy. Um, the little boys love him. Um, when I make a girl one, uh, I'll use girl colors. I'll like do purple, paint, and I actually do hearts for the eyes. And maybe, oh yeah, little nostril um, marks. And actually, if I do a girl, I'll make those shaped like little hearts too. Here, I'm just going to do some little lines. So there you have it. There's a T-Rex. Thanks for watching.